This video is to be used for educational purposes only and is not intended to replace individual research or licensed investment advice. Unique experiences and past performance does not guarantee future results. Trading stocks, options, and spot currencies involves substantial risk and there's always the potential for loss. Your trading results may vary. No representations are being made that any software or training will guarantee profits or not result in losses from trading. This is the Premier Trade Forex Report with Scott Norse. Good afternoon, traders. I'm Scott Norse here with your Forex Report. Today is Tuesday, February 12th, 2008. The U.S. dollar found itself under pressure in the broad market today as stocks clawed higher for a second consecutive day. Credit fears seem to be tamed today after Warren Buffett announced his offers to back several bond insurers. Of course, his offers don't look all that attractive for the other parties involved, and one has already rejected the proposal. Additionally, Treasury Secretary Hank Paulson publicly disclosed a joint effort by some of the nation's largest mortgage lenders to suspend foreclosures for 30 days. This is expected to give delinquent borrowers and their lenders sufficient time to work out new payment structures. While this is certainly good for news for those looking for help, the program has its fair share of critics already downplaying the effects it may have. Finally, San Francisco Fed President Janet Yellen was quoted as saying she expects slow growth but not a recession in the United States this year. With no economic indicators released in the U.S. session, these headlines helped all financial markets get moving. As stocks moved higher, so too did carry trades. While we are not speculating on where stocks are headed in the days or weeks ahead, some yen cross pairs certainly look like they have some room to bounce in that time frame. Beyond there, things are simply too fragile to forecast many weeks or months out today. Looking ahead, we have U.S. retail sales out early tomorrow morning, and Fed Chairman Ben Bernanke is expected to speak on Thursday. Retail sales are not expected to be very strong, but a slight improvement over the dismal December reading. Perhaps Bernanke can help restore more confidence later on this week. Till tomorrow, have a wonderful night trading. Take care.